Often when we begin a decorating project, we sort of think, how do I want it to feel? Do I want it to feel light and airy? Or do I love lots of bright color? Or would I prefer something more moody and dark? And I love this beautiful loft in Montreal designed by Nathalie Bouchard and Annie Horth of Creative Flats. They've actually employed both light and dark elements in a really clever way. The loft is fairly small, about 780 square feet, but it feels very spacious because of the 10-foot ceilings and giant windows. I love the way Annie and Natalie have used the dark paint colors and cabinetry to kind of define the two ends of the space which is a really clever trick because dark paint colors and cabinetry really blur your perception of the perimeter of a space, so it can seem quite a bit larger than it is. The kitchen lines one end of the loft and it's defined not only by the dark cabinetry, but also by the clever paint treatment on the floor. Just the checkerboard treatment alone is enough to sort of announce to you that you're in the kitchen without dividing the space off too much. At the other end of the loft, the bedroom area is also defined by darkness, a dark painted wall as well as a floor to ceiling curtain. It's a great way to create a sort of a cocooning effect in a small space and also add a little bit of drama. The designers have really played up the industrial origins of this space. The windows are spectacular, they've maintained the exposed pipe ceiling, brought in an industrial style coffee table. It definitely feels cozy and welcoming. A lot of that has to do with the beautiful giant Chesterfield sofa, the layered art on the wall, as well as the Persian carpet. I really like the mix of sort of antique furniture, the mid-century references, and then some really eye-catching lighting choices. When you have a great mix of furniture like this, painting the floor is the same color as the wall, the same white, really allows all the elements in the space to pop and you really see the shapes of all the furniture. It's a bit of a gutsy move to paint floors white, but you can see the effect is well worth the effort. The beautiful mix of furniture really pops against the white background. The bathroom is a perfect mix again of the black and white elements. It's small but very efficient and contemporary, but it does have some really interesting style notes like the console sink and also the wall-mounted faucet. This loft project shows that you don't have to choose between dark and light style of decorating. You can combine them both creatively and end up with a warm and welcoming space.